Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So Microsoft Edge version 120 is now available. And this latest release started rolling out late once again in my part of the world on the 7th of December 2023. Now, as always, to double check, we have the update. We head to our main menu, help and feedback about Microsoft Edge. And after this update has been applied, latest version and build is now bumped up to 120.0.2210.61. Now, version 120 is a minor and what we would consider to be a lightweight release. There are really no front-facing features, and at its heart and core, version 120 is really a security and bug fix update. But nonetheless, uh, just to go through what's new, according to the release notes for this latest stable version. First of all, Microsoft says they have fixed various bugs and performance issues, which is common uh, in the Edge browser with major version upgrades. So if you have experienced any issues when it comes to performance, glitches, bugs, and so on, just double check your browsers up to date. And then the Edge browser itself has received three Edge-specific security updates, two of which are information disclosure vulnerabilities, and the last one is a elevation of privilege vulnerability. So three Edge-specific security issues have been patched. And then the Chromium open source project and platform, which the browser is based on, once again has received some important security fixes, which include 10 security fixes and... There are no zero days or exploits in the wild, but we do get two high-risk vulnerabilities, which are both user after free uh, issues, which are common in the open source Chromium uh, browsers. And high risk is your level just under critical. So this is a, an important Chromium security update rolling out. As mentioned, 10 security fixes have been addressed and have been patched and have rolled out with Edge version 120 for the Chromium side of things and three have rolled out for the browser itself. Now, just to go through what's new, and as mentioned, not much. It's a very lightweight release. So if you were expecting any major front-facing features, I think you're going to be disappointed. And the feature update really um, includes extra security benefits, and the Windows native app container is enabled by default. So basically, that's a under-the-hood security um, improvement that's rolled out as listed as a feature update. And then over and above that, um, we get six policy updates, which is really going to be of interest to your system admins and administrators, not really to your average home user. And that's more or less, according to the release notes, what's new in version 120, as mentioned, a lightweight release. But if you are interested, something else I did notice, and I actually posted on this the other day, and I'll leave the video down below. If we head to the customize side panel, side pane, um, I have noticed that the customization options and this new uh, layout has rolled out now and is becoming more widely available. When I posted uh, two days or so ago, this was only available on one of my devices in the stable version. And with this version upgrade has now made its way onto my other device. So it seems now that this new sidebar customization options and layout is also now becoming more widely available. So that's it, guys. That's what's new with this minor lightweight release Edge version 120, which rolled out on the 7th of December. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.